I don't know if sardine connoisseur, but I had some the other day that was pretty good, and I thought, well, what's the difference between um, different brands? I just bought a couple, and I want to compare uh, kind of the more expensive with the uh, super cheap. And so what we're going to talk about today is the King Oscar and uh, the Great Value. So let's take a look. As you can see, the King Oscar is uh, $2.98, nearly $3 bill on that one. Uh, the sardines in soybean oil and the King Oscar is supposedly uh, wild caught in extra virgin olive oil. So it all sounds good. Let's see what the difference in uh, look um, and texture and taste. Right, well, immediately when I opened up the uh, great value, I got a whiff of seafood, a whiff of, of fish. So little less excited about that uh, but we'll just see about taste here i have to have crackers with sardines so i'm pulling the crackers out Pretty good taste. I was a little shocked to see a little bit of, a little more tail than I expected, but actually the one I ate was a lot more tail than I expected. There we go. Here's some tail. So, interesting. All right. Not bad tasting. Uh, the fish appear to be a little bit bigger, actually. On you know, it looks like there's a little more skin involved. On the uh, great value. A little more fishy taste, but not bad. Not a bad taste. Seems a little more salty, I think. Overall, pretty good. We'll go for a, a second bite of both of them on reverse order now. Okay, pretty good. Very edible. I mean, nothing wrong with it at all. The King Oscar is definitely less fishy, and the presentation is a little bit better, I think. But again, both of them are very good. Is it worth um, three times the price? Nearly three times the price? No, I don't, I don't think so. Because the great value tastes pretty good. The, the presentation is not as good. What prompted me to do this was uh, some that I bought 
that was actually King Oscar. And uh, it was, uh, I think they said filleted or, I think skinless filleted. And it, it tasted even better than either of these. Health-wise, King Arthur says 230 calories, 16 grams of protein. Calcium is supposedly 20% of the daily value you're supposed to get. No sugars. 65 milligrams of cholesterol. Sodium, 350 milligrams. So if you're on a low-sodium diet, I guess it would be something to watch. interesting I don't see the oh, so this one I don't see the uh, individual protein and all that breakdown on the um, great value it has the high level stuff that usually goes on the front end of the packaging but it doesn't have the nutritional facts that's interesting I'm sure there's a little more value to olive oil than um, soybean oil. So that's one thing you're paying for on the uh, King Arthur or King Oscar. And a number of the King Oscar. Go back to the great value. See how that taste is holding out in the transition. Definitely got a little more little more of a fishy taste but definitely a uh, smoke taste to it which was good I mean in, in, in a good way it's it's a good smoke taste your great value it just reminds me of camping it just has that good camping taste, smell, feel to it. If you didn't catch any fish, you open this up and make you feel like you caught some fish. I think for presentation, the, the King, uh, King Oscar, but for price and good taste, uh, no problems. I think I'd go for great value, to be totally honest. Bon appétit.